Hello! Today, or like this week, I thought I'd film a week in outfits, just a standard old week in outfits, showing you my outfits every day. I'm gonna make them summery, even though the weather really isn't at the moment, it's just raining every day, or like, it's rain today, but it feels like it's been raining every day. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna make some summery outfits for you, hopefully provide you with some summer outfit inspo. Um, yeah, hopefully you enjoy the outfits. I also forgot to mention, I'm starting this on Tuesday because I didn't think to start it yesterday. Tuesday's close enough to the beginning of the week. Here we are. Um, so this is Tuesday's outfit. Did I wear this the whole day? No. Was I in cycling shorts for most of the day? Of course I was. They're comfy. They stop my thighs from rubbing. Why wouldn't I be? But this is my chosen outfit of the day, my summer inspo outfit of the day. Um, so I've gone for a bit of satin on satin. I don't know why I'm standing with my legs just crossed there, <laughs> but this top is just from Nasty Gal. I'll come and show you it a bit closer. Um, yeah, this top is just from Nasty Gal. It's got these like little cuppy bits and then it goes down into a kind of handkerchief cut, which I think is really cute. And then I got this skirt from Rocket. It's a size large. In what world? I kind of, like, obviously I don't really care about labels and I know I've put on weight recently, um, but it was completely intentional, I needed to. Um, but it makes me feel for people who are larger than me who wouldn't fit into this. I have to put it on over my head because I can't get it past my thighs. And I know I'm not a large girl. Um, so I think Rocket needs to sort out their sizing a little bit. Um, but still, a lovely skirt, lovely pink satin midi skirt. I think it's just really flattering. Also, that's the back of the top. It's kind of like lower um with like thin straps i think it's just really pretty the only thing is it's a bit impractical for wearing outside because it does move around i don't like to wear anything underneath it you can kind of get what problems it might cause um but yeah i just think it's a really cute really simple outfit i've gone for these um sandals on my feet i don't know why i struggled to think of the word sandals they're just from primark actually yeah really comfy really simple yeah i think they're pretty much like my summer standard sandal and that is the outfit really i always wear the same jewelry so you'll see this in all my outfits i normally do wear rings but i left them at my boyfriend's house so that's no good um but yeah that's the outfit i'll see you tomorrow hello it's wednesday this is the outfit. I feel like this is a very simple outfit, but it's only because like, and it's a simple outfit, I don't know what I was gonna try and say. Basically it's quite a simple top and some more funky trousers, but still all together. It's quite simple, but effective. I really like it. I think for me, a simple top and more like jazzy, funky trousers is the winning formula. I can't seem to go wrong with it. So the top is just from Shein. It's just one of these, halter neck style tops. I'll come in a bit closer as well. Probably too close. <laughs> um, yeah, it's just one of those halter neck style tops. And then these trousers are just from Depop. They're getting a little bit small for me now, but they're my favorite trousers. So I will continue to push myself into them because I'm not getting rid of them. I really love them. They're just these kind of like leopard print. It's quite like a fine leopard print. I really like it. Um, but it's also a really nice material. I've got quite sensitive skin on my legs and a lot of materials make my skin like not break out, but get really irritated if I've shaved my legs and then put something on over them. But these trousers don't irritate my legs. I shaved them today, feeling fine. Um, yeah, that's the trousers. Then for my shoes, I've just gone for my docks, my dock boots, because I think they look good with the outfit. <laughs> um, yeah, there we go. That's the simple but effective outfit for today. I am going to put on a jumper as well because it's a little bit chilly out, so I'll show you that one now. So yeah, this is just the jumper I've gone for. It's my old Looney Tunes one, which is from Pull and Bear, I wanna say. I haven't worn it for ages. I completely forgot I had it until recently when I moved and thought, oh, 
I have that jumper. Um, but yeah, I think it's really cute. It's quite nice to have some full length jumpers because I seem to go for like cropped ones all the time, but I think it looks really nice. And that's why I'm wearing it. So this is today's outfit. It's very Mamma Mia 2, Young Donna, cartwheeling through an orange orchard inspired. Um, it's the exact reason that I got the skirt. I just thought it was a great outfit. Wanted to recreate it in my own way and here we are. I feel like I need to wear quite a little top with the skirt because I do have to roll it up, which then looks a little bit bulky. Um, so I like to kind of contrast it with a small top and make me look a little bit... I don't know, it just I feel like it gives me more shape and I like that. So the skirt I think was just from Amazon or something. I think it took me a while to find and I just went for the one that was like most similar to the one in the movie because I really liked it. There we go. The top I think was from Shein, it's just a bikini top. I've had it for a while now and you can probably tell it's a little bit small for me, a little bit tight, but we're working with it. I don't want to have to buy a new one, I can still just about squeeze into it. We're going with it. And then for the shoes, I've just gone for these bulky trainers from Bershka. I quite like the kind of bulky vibe to go with quite a feminine summer outfit. Love a little bit of contrast. And that is it. I'm in a bit of a rush today, but here is the outfit. Top is just from ASOS. I think it was like Missy Empire on ASOS. And it's just this fluffy tank top. It's actually really warm. I thought because it was a tank top, it wouldn't be that warm. I'm sweating a little bit. Then the skirt is just from Depop. I really love it. It's kind of like a double layered skirt. Did burn a hole in the underlayer of the back skirt. It's quite funny because it's like exactly where my bum cheeks are as well. So like if I lift up, the back layer is just cheeks but i'll sew it together all good but yeah i really like it i think it's just really fun and then on my shoes or on my feet oh, i cannot speak today on my feet i've got my docks and some chunky socks and that is the outfit really love it i don't know what it is about it it just all looks great feeling myself having a good time I wanted to wear this for like date night tomorrow, but the skirt took ages to iron and I thought if it's in my bag when I'm going over to my boyfriend's and it gets all crumpled, I'll just be gutted. So I thought I'll wear it today, wear a different outfit tomorrow. So because I had a very busy weekend with date day and night on Saturday and then the Euros final on the Sunday, I didn't get a chance to film either of my outfits and they weren't really anything to shout about anyway. So what I thought I'd do instead was show you a couple of outfits with some things that I've picked up on Vinted lately. So this top I picked up on Vinted last week. I think it was literally a fiver. And then I've just paired it with these dungarees from Monkey. I really like wearing my dungarees with just one strap up. I think like it allows you to see more of the top underneath especially if it is just a tank top like sometimes if I'm wearing a jumper or a long sleeve top I'll just have both straps up but I think it's quite nice when you've got a little top underneath just to see more of the design and then I've got my air force on my feet very simple but quite a nice casual summer outfit so I also got this dress from Vinted. I actually don't know how I'm gonna style it yet, but I thought I would just show you the dress anyway. It's just one of these halter neck ones from American Apparel, which were quite popular back in, I wanna say like 2013, 14 or somewhere around there, but I just never had 30 or 40 quid to spend on a dress back then. So when I saw this on Vinted for like five pounds, I was like, yeah, I'm gonna get it, live out my dreams. Um, but yeah, I don't really know how I'm going to style it yet, so I thought I would just show you as it is and put it with a pair of boots because I wear these boots with everything. And that is everything I've got for the video, so I hope you enjoyed it. Um, hopefully I'm going to do many more of these. They're really not hard to film, so I don't really have an excuse not to do them. I've always got time to just film my outfit for the day. So yeah, let me know if you want to see more of these. I'll obviously try and style things instead of just showing you clothing items i just haven't really figured out how to style this yet but yeah let me know if you want to see more of them or if you're just not that bothered and i will see you soon